Welcome back to the trip through Comics Greatest World, right here on Crypto Comics. This is week three in Cinnabar Flats, King Tiger from Dark Horse. 16 week series, introducing a new character each and every week for only a dollar. Welcome to 1993, my Crypto Knights. Okay, let's get into this. Okay, say it with me. Prologue sequence scripted by who? Mike Richardson. Featuring art by who? That's right. The main story is scripted by Randy Stradley, pencils by Paul Chadwick, and inks by Jimmy Palmiotti. 1962. Two figures crawl toward a fenced off building complex in the Nevada desert. Are you sure we should be doing this? Are you kidding? We bring back a few pictures and we got the scoop of the decade. I still don't like it. What if we're caught? Quit your worrying. This is our big chance. Besides, what could they do anyway? Shoot us? Click. Huh? Blam, blam! Race Bannon is dead. Just like that. Wow. Last week they killed a thing. This week they killed Race Bannon. So. Oh, Lord. This is not barbed wire. I know. You know. If you're just tuning in, you, you're, you need to go way back, way back. I know you're thinking it's barbed wire. No, it's, it's not. This is not barbed wire. This is, this is Tiger King, and he's having him drive in a big circle around the desert. And the, the military's coming in. I'm, yeah, this one wasn't, wasn't too hot. Oh, but I know you like this part, right? Um, our friends here, our interdimensional friends, they decide that they're going to, you know, start scanning the... Uh, the vortex, right? And homeboy here says, My own scan of the energy creature that emerged from the anomaly suggested a composite entity, as if there were more than one being inhabiting a single form. Brother Paimon, what you are saying borders on heresy. It's just the way I do that voice. It's gotta, we gotta have some variety on this show, right? We need equity, or whatever. Yeah, remember I fought the dragon? In Hero Zero last week, and then the dragon split into five different entities. And this is these are the five entities, right? And so this is the story. And you don't really know much about them, but this is cool. So Tiger King's created this weird net made of hands with eyes in them. It's pretty neat. And uh, and he's got these arrows which he's written spells of disillusion on each of the shafts of. I want you two to promise me something. What's that, Tiger? No matter what happens, you must stay on that side of the line. What do you mean? What's going to happen? Stop, Ricky. I'm serious. You must not cross the line. No matter what. Promise me. All right, Tiger. Yeah, sure, but I don't see why. You're about to. Oh, we are about to. And I, wanna, I just want to make it clear, this is not about Joe Exotic. This is not Tiger King. This is King Tiger. And then the spirits come in and, you know, die, demons. And, you know, you know this old chestnut, right? We're going to have a fight with a really cool background. And he just takes that one's head completely off, and I love it. That's all right with me. And he's going to fight. And he's going to fight, and we don't really find out much of anything. And there's a David walking around. That's a Hero Zero, you know. Good times, good times. And he's just checking out what's going on because he saw the car driving around in Hero Zero. And uh, yeah, they're going to fight. And oh no, we've got to do something. He's overwhelmed. Even though he told us not to cross the line, I feel like we have to. Get in the car. Hurry. They get in the car. Drives. Oh, cut. Miserable human. Who is executing whom, little human? What? And this guy, you guys remember him. Uh, he, he's gotten a lot older. Life got really hard after he had that gig there on Moss Eisley in that cantina. You know, it's just, they shut it down, right? Government intervention, you know, shut it down. Just led to a life of crime. It's sad, to be honest with you. No! Huh? Humans? Oh, jeez. Depart now, demon. Dawn is coming, and these people are under my protection. You have won this battle, tiger cub. But the war is far from over. There will be more of us in time, and we will feast on your pain. 
I'm sorry I crossed the line, tiger. I thought those monsters were going to kill you. Given the circumstances, you did the right thing, Ricky. I'm sorry about what happened to your car, though. A girl named Ricky, like Ricky Lake. Weird. Forget the car. Cars can be fixed. The main thing is that you're okay. Yes, I am. This time. I believe I need to rethink my methods. How does the idea of magic bullets strike you? Because <laughs> it's bullet and it's strike. It's <laughs> Continue next week in Comics Greatest World. Vortex. What? A Frank Miller cover? Well, that'll certainly sell. Excerpt from an FBI wiretap on casino owner Reno Laughlin's phone. We're going to meet Reno Laughlin very soon here in Comics Greatest World. Why are we going to meet him? I, I don't know. None of the... None of the characters ever reappear. It's weird. Franco de Blasi. But boss, we have men at all the doors. He must have gotten in some other way. I don't care how we got in. I just want him out. If this Tiger King wins another nickel from my tables, heads will roll. It's a, it's, it's, it's a King Tiger, boss. You mother... Whatever. I'm stupid. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that's King Tiger. Uh, I, I'm interested in this kind of art style. It's different. Definitely different. Um, the story, you know, the art was cool, but I don't... I guess I'm, I'm not caring enough about Comics Greatest World. I don't know if it is the Comics Greatest World, to be honest. But I do know we're, we're almost done, because next week is week four in Cinnabar Flats. It is Out of the Vortex. As we continue our journey... Through the Comics Greatest World imprint from Dark Horse, right here at Crypto Comics. I will see you next time, all my Crypto Knights.